Hi, <clears throat> this is Paul. I wanted to make a quick video about my favorite TV shows that I'm watching, of course, in 2020. Okay, I watched God, God Friended Me. That comes on CBS on Sunday nights and Channel 2. Okay, that's about a guy who's a blogger who's been chosen by a guy. He gets friend requests, and he goes around the city helping people, basically. That's what it is. It's like Touched by an Angel, except the three friends. Okay, and the lead character, Miles, he's the lead character in it. He has two friends with him. Uh, and it's a real good show on CBS. Okay, of course, I watch Supergirl, which comes on on the WV, or CW, as it's now known. Supergirl, you know, so still a little preachy and stuff, but Melissa Manoy makes everything better. And so that's why I still watch that show. Okay, and of course, I reluctantly watch Batwoman because I still think Ruby Rose is mis was miscast as uh, Batwoman. But she's getting better, and like I said, the other people around her are getting better, so I still watch it anyway. Okay, and of course, Monday, I watch uh, Prodigal Son, which uh, comes on. Michael Sheen, he's the father. Uh, I forgot the actor who plays uh, the main character, the Prodigal Son. He used to be Jesus on Walking Dead. Okay, uh, he just cut his hair, obviously. And it's a real good show, psychological thriller about a guy whose father's a serial killer, and he helps the cops, you know, get killers and stuff. And it's a real good show, actually, on Fox at 9 o'clock on Mondays. And then, of course, I watch The Flash, which comes on... Uh, CW, of course, on Tuesdays. You know, I love The Flash. So I love the cast, too. So I still watch that. And, of course, um, I don't watch Arrow anymore because it's went off, technically went off, actually. And they did a backdoor pilot, which I really didn't like the backdoor pilot thing. But who knows if it's picked up or not. Okay, but there you go. I used to watch Arrow, but that's over now. And then uh, DC's Legends, which I reluctantly watch now somewhat. I liked it in the past seasons and stuff, but, you know, they got rid of all the people of color on that show. So, really, I don't really watch it as much as I used to. And Brandon Roth is leaving, which is going to make it even worse. You know, the only person I really like on that show is Sarah right now. So, but, we'll say in Constantine, but that's about it. Anyway, okay, now, on uh, Wednesday is Riverdale, which I still watch. This show is wacky and outrageous. And Archie Andrew gets in, and his crew get into so much weird things happening in that show. Uh, but it's still crazy, and it's sort of like Twin Peaks on steroids for young kids, and I still watch it. Okay, and then we got a new show on on CBS, uh, not CBS, on CW, comes right after Riverdale's called Nancy Drew. I really like the cast in this, and like Nancy, the actress who plays Nancy, and she got a real good supporting cast with her, and some about a mystery about who killed this woman and stuff, and it's a real good show, actually, so I still watch that. Okay, and then on Thursdays, I watch Legacies, which is on the second season, on the CW, and this is from the creators of uh, Vampire Diaries and the originals, and it's a real good cast on the show, Supernatural Vampires and everything else, and the cast is real strong on this show, and I really like the storylines on this show, so I it's probably one of my favorites. Okay, and then on Thursday nights, the show that just ended, it was only like a 13-episode first season, I believe, and it got already renewed for the second season, so I'll get looking forward to that. I'm talking about Evil on CBS, which I really like about a priest in training, a psychologist and a carpenter who's like a non-believer. Okay, they're basically battling evil on that show. It's a really good show, very unusual. Okay, very good. Okay, uh, very underrated. Okay, and then on Fridays uh, we have Lincoln Ryan, which just started. I think it's on the fourth episode now. Okay, that's about uh, based on the movie in the book. Uh, Lincoln Ryan, the Hunt for the Bone Collector, and this is a really good show about you know, you know basically they they're solving cases, but the Bone Collector is like in the forefront, and he is still like teasing you know, coming back, and he actually came back in this last episode, come back to confront uh, Link and Ryan again, so this is a real good show, it's getting good. Okay, and then of course I watch Picard, which comes on Thursdays as well, I believe, uh, okay, on the uh, CBS All Access. I love anything Star Trek, and I love uh, Patrick Stewart, so I definitely watch that. And of course I watch Power, which is going to be the last episode, which I believe starts, to, the last episode of this six and final seasons is tonight, so i got to watch that. Okay, I really, uh, so I've got to get into it. I didn't see the first season, but then after that, I got into it and really enjoyed the show about, you know, this guy who's, you know, in this power in New York City, him and his friends and stuff, and battling the feds and trying him trying to go straight, trying to be legit. And he was having an affair with his child, sweetheart, who was actually a DA, you know, not DA. Uh, she works for the FBI and just a bunch of drama, but it was really actually good, good action and stuff. This is produced by 50 Cents. A really good show, a real good cast in this, and this is going to be the last season. And they're supposed to do a spinoff of it, I think. And hopefully it's not with his son, because I can't stand the son's character on this show. So hopefully they won't ever do that, okay? Because I can't stand the son character on this. His name is Tariq. Oh, my God, I can't stand that guy. So they talk about a spinoff, so I pray it's not with him. 
because I, I will not watch it because I cannot stand the character and I can't stand the actor. Okay, okay, I know his fault because <laughs> he's just playing a part, but I just can't stand that character. Okay, so those are my main shows. And okay, um, I do watch uh, Homeland, which is coming back I think tonight, the final season. I watched that, love that show. And uh, what else? Uh, ch -ch 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 -ch. Homeland. Uh, I watch a little bit of Shameless. Uh, and then what else? Uh, ch -ch 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 -ch. Oh, the show, I've got the show, it's by Financial Guy, I've got the name of it. Billions, Billions, that's another good show that's, I think, going to come back in a couple of months on Showtime. That's another good show. So those are my shows. Anyway, let me know what you, what your favorite shows are, and uh, feel free to let me know down below. Let me know what you think of my shows. And this is Paul saying so long, and take care.